Natasha Monsell was 15 when the juvenile justice system sent her to the YDC in 2001. I was a victim of sexual assault. I was a, a victim of emotional abuse, mental abuse. Victor Malave of Guilford is among those named in her suit. He was arrested in April on sexual assault charges. Corinne Murphy was 15 when she arrived at the YDC in 1996. Jeffrey Buskey of Litchfield arrested this spring on sexual assault charges. He's among those named in her suit. I have nightmares. I have crippling anxiety. They are the fourth and fifth plaintiffs from an initial class action suit to now file individually. Attorney Russ Riley says another 380 so far will follow, all alleging abuses at the Sununu Youth Development Center and former youth detention services spanning six decades and 150 staffers. I didn't have a voice back then. I didn't feel like I could have spoken up and um, people would listen and actually care. The Attorney General's office announced a comprehensive criminal investigation in 2019 and has made several arrests so far. It helps that people are coming forward, but it hurts a lot at the same time that so many people were put through so many horrific things that it, it really, like, it, it hurts my soul. These women so bravely willing to speak up and be identified, empowering others to know that people will listen and do care. We're live in Portsmouth, Jennifer Crompton, WMUR News 9.